Hi, I'm Jennifer Kim, Korean healthcare analyst at Morgan Stanley Research. Today, I'm with Citizens CEO, Dr. Jong Yun Chan. So your company's multiplex real-time PCR technology is very unique. Uh, what are the differentiating points compared with global competitors such as Roche's Tangman or DNA chips? Well, first of all, I appreciate uh, to have this opportunity. Uh, the current real-time PCR technology can detect one or three different targets in a single reaction. But CISEN's real-time PCR technology simultaneously can detect more than 10 different targets in a single reaction. This is quite different. Not only three times better than the current technology, specificity, sensitivity, reproducibility is the same as a single-plex real-time PCR, even if we are high multiplex approach. Regarding to the DNA chip, chip method cannot compete with the real-time PCR in terms of the specificity and sensitivity because their method required hybridization and amplification step. These two steps bothering the specificity and sensitivity. So you have the best-in-class technology and very broad infectious disease DNA testing menu. However, top line growth has been slower than expected. What are the main reasons? Yes, uh, nowadays, time to time, I'm hearing these questions. Uh, we had uh, two choices. One is uh, market development, and the other is uh, technology development. In our case, very much focused on technology development until now, instead of the market development. That will be main reason. Uh, because although current our technology is better than any other existing real-time PCR technology, that does not mean our technology is perfect. Mm -hmm. We are looking for perfect technology in real-time PCR. Finally, we have chance to develop such perfect and final real-time PCR technology. Using such perfect real-time PCR technology, we developed product we call Allplex and launched on the market. Nowadays, the revenue of the Allplex product dramatically increased. Could you tell us about your new universal oligo catcher system? Yeah, this is great to introduce our new technology. Uh, current uh, the real-time PCR technology requires uh, target-specific fluorescence oligonucleotide systems for each of the target detection. But the universal catcher system can detect uh, hundred or a thousand different target detection using only one fluorescence labeling. This is quite unique in the real-time PCR market. The last over 30 years, uh, just in you know, a common sense is uh, for the one target, one fluorescence, mm -hmm. uh, we broke through the, this concept. It means uh, we have chance to save the the development cost, mm -hmm. development time, compared to the existing method. The existing method means uh, for the one assay development uh, mm -hmm. is taking over one year. We can develop one assay development within a month. This is you know the tremendous uh, the differences between existing hours. Mm -hmm. That's why we are expecting that our approach will replace uh, existing real-time PCR technology with the season's real-time PCR technology. Your company has tied up with three global top-tier in vitro diagnostics players, including mm -hmm. Beckman, Kultur, Qazin, mm -hmm. and BD. Mm -hmm. So we think your ODM business model is key growth driver of the next 10 years. Right. What is your view on growth potential for ODM business? Right. Yeah, the, we focused on ODM business recently. That's why we have this opportunity. I appreciate this opportunity. Uh, we are expecting uh, the 30 to 50 million revenue per item within two, three years after we launched uh, ODM product on the market because the market is looking for high multiplex menu. The global company, although they have a fully automated real-time instrument, their menu is uh, most of the case a single plex or two or three plex. It means they do not have a high multiplex real time PCR product. Also, market is looking for more menu, so that's why we are expecting such a rapid growth. 
Uh, that's why we are also supporting our ODM partners to expand uh, their product uh, lineup. Dr. Chun, thank you for taking the time for this interview. Thank you.